Hello everyone! Today we are in the Philippines and we will visit a few stores and check the South Sea Pearls. South Sea Pearls can be found not only in the Philippines, also Myanmar, Australia and Indonesia, as well as Polynesia. But today we are filming from uh, Manila and we will check a few stores which offer these beautiful pearls for sale. Let's go! Just let me mention a few words about the South Sea Pearls. There are two types, silver lipped, which produce uh, white to silver cultured pearls, and it's more common south of the equator. And the gold lipped, which can produce pearl color in rich golden color hues, is more common north of the equator. South Sea Pearls are very unique. They come from very large mollusks, the Pink Tada Maxima oysters. And these oysters are capable to produce almost perfectly round lustrous pearls reaching over 20 millimeters in diameter. These are the largest cultured pearl variety. For comparison, uh, normal pearls called Akoya, they are much smaller. Their size is up to 9 millimeters. And the South Sea pearls just start at 9 millimeters and go up all the way to 20 millimeters. As we can see, this oyster has produced very large pearls and therefore it takes up to five years to produce a single South Sea pearl in the ocean, whereas more common freshwater oysters can take as little as three months and create dozens of pearls. This long cultivation process makes South Sea pearls more rare and this, as a result more expensive. These are rare. As the longer they are in the ocean, they are more endangered uh, to, due to global climate change, uh, chemicals, spills, external uh, threats, etc. Uh, during the cultivation, 75% of the oysters die. And it's also quite difficult to match the, the colors and the shape to make like, for example, this kind of string. That's why you can see more tendency for graduated uh, necklaces, uh, graduated uh, strings. It makes more sense because it's easier to match and make a necklace. It's nice, no? It's Is it gold? Silver, no. How much? Almost 170 mom. I'm gonna have a special discount. Really? Yeah. 25%. Hundred twenty. So with a suggested discount in twenty five percent, the price was uh, one hundred twenty seven thousand Filipino pesos, which converts to approximately two thousand three hundred forty US dollars. Unfortunately, I didn't have budget and even plan to buy. So let's go check something cheaper. That's always a great choice. Pearl Starts is a classic, so I decided to consider this choice. Let's have a closer look and I will comment on the prices as well as the size of the pearls. The choice is just amazing. You can choose the shade, uh, the color, the diameter of the pearl whatever you like and even the metal that is in silver and that is in the gold which makes the price a little bit different how much these are almost thirty nine thousand. same as same price and the smaller one the like this, like this. Mm -hmm. this one is all 14 karat gold and it's mm -hmm. and the medium is almost twenty seven thousand. As you can see, the choice is amazing and the price varies from $300 to $700. You can choose whatever suits your uh, budget. Also, I want to mention that uh, the selection is huge and there is many retailers who offer the South Sea Pearl. So you can move on and check other options like I did here. I went to another shop and the choice is also stunning and the prices are much more Pleasant. Let's have a closer look. You can see there is different uh, shades and the intensity of the color. The saucy pearls, both white and yellow. 
There is also gray and the um, pistachio color. I will show you later. I will try a few of these uh, pearls. Uh, pearl studs on my ears so you can have a look. And uh, I'll also comment a little bit on the sizes and its practicality on the ears. I'm trying the medium size, which is around 12 millimeters. It suits well. I think it's one of the most uh, optimal version for wearing wearing on the ears if you are planning to wear it long time. Uh, however, have a closer look. It really suits large ears, like I have large ears. These are the biggest size, and I think they are too much. Even though they are more expensive and they are more rare, I don't think it's a good option for stud earrings because they pull the ear down and it doesn't look that amazing. I think larger pearls will be good for necklace. In addition to size variety, there is amazing color variety. Look at this uh, pistachio color. <laughs> I don't know, the lady said it's so super and she said it's a natural color. About this, I'm not sure because by research it says it doesn't give this color. However, these earrings are stunning and really I fell in love with those amazing piece and it's so like unique i have never seen these colors and shades before also there is few shades of brown color like even i would say cacao or chocolate color they are also amazing i really love it i will try it also now and uh, let's have a look uh, I guess it's around also 12 millimeters, um, sorry. And the, the next one, the yellow gold is um, nine millimeters. So you can see the difference. And on the ears, they also look amazing, unique, sophisticated, classy piece. And there is also the set. What is the pendant, uh, earrings, uh, and some kind of uh, bangles you can find also different strings of pearls as you can see more sophisticated models with uh, some uh, stones i'm not sure diamonds or cubic zirconia some of them are in gold some of them are in silver some are gold plated but i like this gold string it's uh, 14 karat gold i'll try it now that's really unique piece and these are more chunky pieces which also look great. But in my opinion, these tones are extra for the pearls. The pearls itself have enough luster and shine. Sorry, this uh, necklace was uh, 18 karat yellow gold and uh, with a one pistachio pearl the price was 60,000 pesos. You can add as many pearls as you want, or you can keep one. It's up to you, which is the beauty of this of this uh, jewelry piece. But it was 60,000 pesos, which in my opinion is too much. I think it's too much expensive. It's $1,100. Better you buy the full string of South Sea pearls in yellow color, in my opinion. I also tried a few rings, they are just stunning, amazing pieces. But again, I'm not sure how to wear those in everyday life. Maybe it's not designed to wear it every day, of course. But even it's quite big and quite chunky. So it might be quite disturbing to put it in the pockets or in the bag if you need to take your phone out of the bag. Uh, there is also the whole set. The price with a discount was 128,000, which is around uh, 2,300 US dollars. Even though these are real diamonds, in my opinion, it's still quite expensive, considering the size of the South Sea pearls. And yeah, I think it's better to take the full uh, string. But I really love these earrings. Look at these pretty earrings. Reminds me Dior, 
earrings you can wear it both sides with a smaller on the top or bigger pearl on the top so the price for this earrings was uh, 465 us dollars which is a good price i think for this kind of earrings one more uh, ring with the pearls and the diamonds and there is also the matching earring set so if you like sets you can choose there is many options available also in case you want to make your own design of the jewelry you can buy uh, the pearls with uh, no holes so like this piece all these uh, pearls have no hole and please um, pay attention on this glass on the corner i asked the seller why you would put the glass with the water and she said to keep the moisture level it's very important to keep the luster of the south sea pearls to keep us to keep the air moisturized so quite an interesting fact and for those patient viewers who are still with me in this minute uh, the small tip or advice from the Filipino expert how to take care of your South Sea pearls. Clean it or moisturize it with damp cloth and not uh, using a type of chemical soap on it. Our journey here comes to the end and uh, thank you for watching to this moment i really appreciate and hope it was interesting and useful for you see you in the next videos don't forget to subscribe bye bye